Thank you, Chris. Need something to do over the summer? How about read a book? Mm -hmm. We know you've already been out at the swimming pools. Yeah. Uh, so why not join a book club right here in Charlotte? Joining me now is Arden McLaughlin from Arden's Book Club. Yes, hi. She's a birthday girl. She's not going to mention it, but happy birthday. Oh, thank Belated, you. Thank right? Thank you. Yeah, I was yesterday. <laughs> happy birthday. Thank you. What are you reading? That's what you brought That's in today, what I brought right? In. Do so people ask you that a lot? All the time. So anytime someone sees me out, um, which is always interesting to me because I'm generally in no makeup and they still recognize me, which is <laughs> well for how welcome, I look right now. Welcome to our world. Right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we don't wear makeup a lot. Um, so I brought in really what I'm reading now. Okay. So the first one is I was lucky enough to get a pre-copy of Emily Giffen's latest book. It's actually out tomorrow. It's all we ever wanted. So I actually heard her speak at the Charlotte Mecklenburg Library Foundation event Friday and she's hilarious but I really will point out that this book is a little bit different than the other ones you've read by her and most of her friends have read all of them three times over um there's she actually talks from the first person from three different people she talks from a male character and it really addresses an issue a social media issue that a lot of people face with their p kids right now mm. like she talked about apparently there's a thing called Finsta fake Instagrams. Mm -hmm. I've You've heard, heard a story it. on it. Yeah. yeah. Um, so thinking about that, but just the repercussions of actions and the female is a female lead character and what she has to, what she learns through the whole process. So mm -hmm. it's out tomorrow. Go ahead and pre-order it. Get it probably in your I'm house tomorrow. Giffen. Yeah. Yeah. Love okay. her. The second, Bob Goff. Everybody always. So Bob Goff is all about love and like living out of love and what action love looks like and so this is his new his latest um just kind of what living a life of love looks like and how even when you have setbacks how you move forward through it and mm. told in his general story way so i love it um always a bob golf fan <laughs> the last one i'm always rereading <laughs> about once a year my friend joy calloway wrote this the fifth avenue artist society it's my favorite book of all time. Like yeah, she laughs. I could, I could tell you've been it's, through it's this a few times. It's been through a few times. <laughs> I probably need to get another copy because it'll start falling apart. It's just the story of everyone asks me, what am I reading? Always reading this and recommend this, number one. Story of um, a young girl growing up when in early in the early century when men and women weren't like collaborating together, but there was this Fifth Avenue Artist Society where women and women started collaborating together and how Jenny, the main character, comes to herself. I just completely identify with her. And yeah. So I'm always reading this. If you ever ask me, this is the first book I'm ever going right. to recommend to you. This is a guarantee right guarantee. here. Guarantee. All right, awesome good book. stuff. Where can people yeah. find you online? Ardensbookclub.com. Okay, yeah. thank you. Good to see thank you. Thank you. we got a final check of weather next on WBTV News 3 at noon. But first, here's a look at